Okay, so I am doing a good receipt against a PO and while checking this, I am getting an error. This is not the error, this is the story location. So I will just enter the story location here and I will check this and okay, creating a batch is saying automatically it's creating a batch. That's okay. Checking, okay. It's saying document okay now i'm going to post it it's saying posting period 007 2023 is not open okay so how to fix this error let me open another section okay to fix this error first in obbo we need to create a posting period variant for my company code so I will use OBBO. <clears throat> so I will go for a new entry. Let's say Z CC1 is my company code. I create on the same thing. I need to assign my post period variant to my company code OBBP. Transaction code OBBP. So here I will go to my company code date is the one. I will remove this 1000 variant and I will simply insert my variant. This is not the company code. I created a variant on date is one, the same name. A company code okay. I enter, I save this. This is done okay. Now, the next step is OB52. OB52. This is important okay. Here, let us understand okay. Let's say this is 1000 the standard, 1000 is the variant. So, we have defined our variant JCC1. So, this is called uh, account type loss means all account type you can get you can able to see k for asset d for customer uh, b for k for vendor m for material s for gl account b for contracted account okay these are all type of account okay under 1000 there are multiple things are there class a d a k m s so you need to create the same thing for your company code for your company code variant that you created new one for JCC1, you need to change from 1000 to JCC1 with all this A, D, K, M and plus. Okay. Now, the next step is what is this? Okay. This is something uh, by default is saying that, that, that. So, from period to period. So, this is important. Okay. What is this from period to period? So, there is a in, in finance, there is a fiscal year. Fiscal year uh, is considered okay. Some some of the company uh, consider January as one, February as two, uh, like likewise uh, December as twelve, and some of the company consider April as calendar uh, period one. Similarly for May, is considered for two. Okay, like March they will consider the closing period twelve. From April to March they will they will consider the uh, financial posting period. Okay. Similar way from my company, you, whatever your as for your company, you, you need to decide and you need to define that posting period from January to December, or from which period you need to take that from April to March. Okay, and this is the year that you have to change to your current year. Okay, now next thing, this is what is this 13 to 16. Okay, so as per finance, there are some four special periods that you need to define. Okay, there are four special periods from 13 to 16. Okay, that you need to mention here. So 
so let us do the th activity here i will copy all the things all the count type there is a copy option i will change this to that's is one from variant that i created okay copy this Now, this I will change to 2023. This also I will change to 2023 from January to December. Okay. And, my, and, and I, I have another four additional period okay. now I enter six numbers are records are copied now i scale this this is now saved okay go back now i will take this good receipt again and okay, now i will check and post this okay uh, let me do once again 